Come on, fishy, fishy. Come on, fishy, fishy. Come on. Let's do it. Let's do it. There we go. Nice fish. I'm fishing the South Shore Beach. These big waves here with a storm shad. There was some peanut bunker around. So I'm just trying to work these waves. And here we go. You, the, the moon tides there and what they call breaking tides where you, you coincide slack with sunrise. Um, are always gonna, you know, throughout the season, are always gonna have some, somewhat of a type of top water bite. People ask me a lot, what's in my canal bag? It changes a little bit now and then, but for the most part, most of the stuff stays pretty much the same. Where it gets tricky is, is when those, those tides aren't there, but the fish are, and you gotta find them. You know, how, the, how they set up in rips and, and the jigging and, and, and whatever it would be to, to get them to eat. That's when it gets tough. That's, 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 that's where it separates the, the men from the boys. Even 20 pound fish in the canal can exploit weaknesses in your gear. Never mind if you hook the fish of a lifetime and they do go through there with regularity. So before you even make a cast, you want to make sure that everything is in tip top shape. And that way, if, if there's a failure, it's all on you. I expect to get hit right about there. There you go. It makes a really strong knot and it's been very effective for me. A lot of guys will say, well, I tie this knot, I tie that knot. I used to tie knots all the time and I'd have a break off every now and again. Bucktails, if you had nothing else but smiling bill heads, would be just fine, all right? So, you know, there's the one thing. And then the other thing, the big mistake I see is most anglers um, that are inexperienced with bucktails, they go too heavy. So the, the things to think about are uh, the water depth. Hi, uh, this is Tommy Cargan from Surfcasters Journal, extreme angler extraordinaire. Nighttime fisherman dude, out here in the rugged South Shore waters, trying to rip some laps with some super strike darters on some monster bass. Oh, oh. oh you sucker. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, he came off. I'm gonna kill myself. Days gone by. Me mind be bent on rambling. To Ireland I did fly. <laughs> I stepped on board a vision carried with the wind. And at last I came to anchor at the cross at Spencer Hill. It was the 23rd of June, the day before the fair. 